York. Seasonable temperatures out there, not just over the next few days, but for the most part throughout the 10 day forecast. Our next best chance of rain comes on Thursday, so just less than a week from now. And then next weekend, the first full weekend in January, we could also have some rain out there on Sunday. Don't have any big snow chances on the forecast. Maybe some rain or wet snow mixes in with that rain out there next Sunday. If that system still holds something, we'll be monitoring, but I'm not seeing any accumulation. But I am seeing some light showers out there tonight. This is not radar. This is not what's happening currently, but this is future weather as to what could happen. Notice some rain impacting parts of Northern Virginia into the metro area, Prince George's counties and Southern Maryland as we head toward eight, nine o'clock tonight. Nothing too heavy out there, but again, some of us, especially around Washington and areas to the south, could be dealing with some showers out there over the next few hours. Heading into the overnight hours, we do dry out. And then throughout the day tomorrow, we'll have a mix of clouds and sunshine. Not a bad day for late December. Temperatures right on track with where we should be. We warmed near 50 degrees. Going to be a colder start, though, tomorrow morning than it was this morning with temperatures in the 30s, 38 in Washington upper 20s, low 30s in the suburbs. And again, notice the mix of clouds and sunshine throughout the day. It's a dry day for New Year's Day on Sunday. It's cool if you're headed out New Year's Eve. Dry temperatures for the evening hours will be in the 40s and then cloudy on New Year's Day. Maybe some sprinkles, some light showers out there later in the day on Monday with breezy winds on Tuesday, a high temperature of 47. There you see that chance of rain next Thursday, next Sunday as well. Again, maybe next Sunday, maybe we have some wet snow mixing in, especially back in our western mountain zone. But I'm not seeing any, you know, accumulating snow, yeah, right. at least over the next 10 days. But again, you know, here in our area, we expect more snow in January and February. Mm -hmm. Also, with our changing climate, we're seeing our snow diminish in the winter a little bit and actually increase in the spring a little bit. Oh, oh. Plenty of time left. Of snow. But it's hard not to get complacent when you see these temperatures time and time again. Right. But you have to keep forgetting it's still only. December. Yeah, it's just, right. it's just yeah. the beginning. Yeah. Really yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. <laughs> Thanks, Amelia. Uh, so, you know, newly named Commander's starting quarterback, Jacoby Brissett, was in limited practice today and listed as questionable to play Sunday because of a hamstring injury. And if he can't go, Sam Howell. I am one start. ladies' Under man. Name of the channel, Indiana one ladies' man today. cooking for it's beginners. Defense, one that got stronger after trading for Chase Young. Mm -hmm. Team Insider.